30 years ago, it was all outdoor climbing. There was no indoor climbing. And as we started trying harder and harder routes, we built our own climbing walls out of just a couple of sheets of plywood and we'd shape these plastic holds to resemble the holds that we were training for. It was pretty raw. These things were in basements and in garages and music was loud and it wasn't for everybody. And we've, we've come a long way since those days. So based on the explosion of indoor climbing, Bailey and I worked with Prana and some of their athletes to explore the effects that climbing and urban culture are having on each other. So this growing climbing community is being influenced more by art and by fashion and by architecture and, and just the hustle and bustle of urban life. And so the question is, what effect does this mashup of influences have on the climbing community? And what do these new climbers take from climbing into their daily lives? The influence of modern architecture is evident in a place like the Dumbo Boulders. This is what people expect now from the climbing gym. And the first thing we notice is just how packed the new gyms are. There's an energy in the room that's supportive and inclusive across the board. You'll see climbers working side by side on problems of varying difficulties. One might be a V2, the other might be working on a V12. And they're laughing and sharing data and getting to know each other. Take Barcelona, for example. Barcelona has this killer weather and rich climbing heritage. And now Charm is living in downtown Barcelona and he's opened up a climbing gym and it's not, it's not just a place to train, it, it's become a social center and it's packed every night. Sure, I mean, that's the thing I always tell people about it, too, is that it's not like you're going to the gym and like, oh, I gotta go and do my, like, 100 reps. Yeah. It's yeah. like, you just go have fun, and it's like a, a side effect of going climbing is that you get in great shape. Climbing is alive and well and in good hands, and it's its own thing, you know, this, this growing community, it's its own thing, and it's, some of the people will never go outside, and some of them will, and they'll start traveling and sharing ideas, and that's, that's where it gets interesting, you know, and the momentum is building, I mean, the genies doesn't go back inside the bottle, <laughs> so this is our community.